Hey guys, it's Megan and welcome to today's video. I have a Dollar Tree Halloween DIY to share with you guys. It's the skeleton hand candy bowl I am obsessed with, so let's get started. I took two of these skeleton hands from Dollar Tree and then I took some of this Krylon matte black spray paint and then I also took these tongs and spray painted them as well. You could use any color spray paint that you wanted to or you could just keep them white, whatever you wanted to do, but I just wanted to go ahead and make mine black. I realized I was going to need one more piece to finish off this candy bowl, so I took this candlestick from Dollar Tree. I already had it on hand because I use it all the time, and I spray painted that black as well. I picked up two of these mixing bowls from Dollar Tree because I wasn't sure which size I wanted to use. I ended up going with the bigger size. Obviously, you could use a different kind of bowl if you wanted to. I just wanted the silver, like stainless steel look bowl with it. Then I just took some fix-all glue from Dollar Tree and glued the um, bowl right on top of the candlestick and I let that dry for a little while. You could paint the bowl if you wanted to, but I just kept mine plain like this. Then I took the first skeleton hand and I placed hot glue right on the bottom of it and stuck it right on the base of the candlestick for it to stick to that area. And then I realized I'm going to need it to stick a little bit closer to the bowl as well. So I put some hot glue down at the bottom to really secure it there and then I put some hot glue right at the fingertips where it meets the bowl. So that is really important to make sure you get some glue right where the fingertips meet the bowl. Then I went ahead and did that to the other side. I put the glue on the bottom, stuck it on the base of the candlestick and then added glue where the hands or the fingers meet the bowl again. Since I had some glue that was showing through on the bottom and on the hand, I went ahead and took some um, black paint and just touched it up in the areas where you could see the glue. And once you touched up and put some black over the glue, you couldn't even notice the glue at all. Then I took this skeleton tongue and I cut it down. It would be easier if you had a little handsaw and did it that way, but I just used a big old knife and I was able to cut it down with a little bit of work. So it's doable with a knife. And there you have it, a super spooky, cool looking candy dish. I used the tong to be a little scooper for the actual candy. I did wash this tong a couple times with soap and water. So just a little FYI, it's not just spray paint in the candy, it was washed. But obviously if you don't feel comfortable spray painting it and using that as like a little scooper, you could just leave it white how it came, which would be super cute as well. I love the way this turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you did subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more Halloween DIYs and lots of other videos coming your way thank you all so much for watching I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you in my next video bye